Yeah, no more music for now. Let's see what else we got. What is this place? Um, okay, it's not on the map, so maybe there's no one here. stuff. It's high noon. Okay, so let's see here. What else we got? What else we got? Okay, we got a base up there. My Oh wait, no, that's not a base. That's just a golden crescent. You know what? Since we're taking out everything on the way to the real mission, I might as well take out that fucking key too. And let's let's call our horse. Where are you at? Where are you at, horsey? Horsey, there you are. It's awesome that you can ride a horse in the in a modern game like this. Everything's realistic. I bet he even takes the shit, too. Oh, that was kind of glitchy. This is really cool, too. You can, like, slump over. So, like, if somebody's coming by, they'll just see the horse and be like, Oh, it's just a horse, you know. Or you can slump on this side. Or you can tell the horse to fuck off. And then the horse will fuck off. Or just stand there. Whatever. Oh, I've never been here before. Yeah, that's... Well, uh, there's another one. Oh, shit, I can't remember. Assassin's Creed, but they don't use horses that much. Maybe, um... Like, the first Assassin's Creed, I think, is the only one that uses horses, though. Is there any... Oops. No, I didn't want to call my horse. Uh, it doesn't seem like there's anyone here. It's a curling NASCAR. That's what that sound is. Although you can tell they tried to do different than a normal uh, breaking sound effect. Wait a minute. Is that all that's here? Nothing? I wasted my time, goddammit. I should probably uh, get rid of this. Oh, Sandstorm, no! Actually, that's so fucking far away, I might as well call my horse again. Yay, horsey! I don't think you can use the horse in all the missions, but um, you can in Afghanistan, because I think... Uh, because of the rocky terrain. Man, I can't believe how much time I've spent on this. And this is just a side mission. It's not even the story mission. Because it's just so much fun taking out fools. Why am I going... What's going on? Oh, I'm getting routed by a big freaking rock in my way. A 
So, uh, Alex, I never played Red Dead Redemption. Does Red Dead Redemption have a uh, landscape like this? I'm assuming it does. Where you can just ride around wherever you want. Because I, I, that's one game that I need to play, which is a really good one. Oh, and more desert out there. Let's see here. Um, so it's just right over there. God, this looks awesome. You never played it either? <laughs> well, we both need to play it, I guess. It's just so stunning to take in this landscape. It's awesome. Now go away. Get, get. I love that. You know, it's funny. I carry this big ass gun, but I never use it because I don't like killing people. I'm a peaceful man. And also, how are they going to join my army if they're dead? So. That's, that's such a brilliant idea. Let's steal people from another army and put them in our army. Because basically, like I said, every time you extract someone, they're going to be, they're going to be, um, oh shit. They're going to be, uh, oh shit, did they see me? No, but you're basically extracting them to be brainwashed. It's awesome. <laughs> okay, you're turning around for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah, they did, for sure. It's, it's not endless, though. There's like a point where... It'll say you're going outside the mission range and it'll stop you, but... So that's how they deal with, with uh, borders. Which is probably the only... One of the hard parts in doing open world. But the biggest thing with an open world game, you have to have stuff in it to do. And this has stuff to do. So it's not too bad. Because what's the point of doing open world if you don't have stuff to do? You don't have fools to take out. I better get up there before someone notices him and wakes him up. Because it's just a trank, so they can just, uh, they can just kick you to wake you up, so... Luckily no one noticed. Come on, asshole, come on. Yay! I make it look really easy, but I am just being, I'm just really lucky. I'm gonna have to request more ammo too. Join my army or die, motherfucker. I, I love that. I wish I could find, uh, cause there's animals out- Oh no! Oh, that didn't work. Damn it. Yeah, the Fox engine is amazing. It's too bad now it belongs to Konami and it'll never be used for anything good ever again. Fucking assholes. But I'm sure, I'm sure, well, Kojima and his team they created the Fox Engine, so it wouldn't be hard for them to replicate it. I mean, they'd have to make it different, of course, because uh, because Konami would be like, "No, you're 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 copying it." Yeah, but Konami's gonna do more shitty Metal Gear, though, because I'm pretty sure Kojima is leaving after this game. At least I hope he does, because Konami can suck a dick these days, so.
Konami used to be one of the greatest AAA companies ever, but now they're just like, they're like a joke compared to what they used to be. Like, have you heard what they did to Silent Hills? Yeah, you probably heard that they canceled Silent Hills, but what you might not have heard is that they fucking turned Silent Hills into a casino pachinko machine. So it's like, what the fuck? It's because gambling is legal in Japan and and they want to capitalize on that. That's basically that's base. Oh, did I remove the marker? I didn't need to do that. Yeah, they turned they turned Silent Hills into a pachinko machine. Let me give you the link for that real quick, actually, because uh, let's see. So let's see. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Okay, so here's the video for it. If you're interested. It's it Now this is a guy who uh who reported on it. Uh, I don't know where you can read the actual news on it, but it's it did happen and they released like a they released a trailer for it and it's like oh shit is there a diamond uh, if you find diamonds that gives you so much money don't imagine there's much there's many diamonds in that okay there's there's nothing between here and there so I'm gonna call my horse the Okay. Oh, we're going back here? Oh, I hate this place. So we're finally at the mission place. Actually, before I start this, I need to get more ammo. So, let's call in. Uh, let's call in the supply drop. Let's go ahead and wait for that. Get to get in. Stay back. Oh, the Yay! Another prisoner extraction.
Actually, let's go ahead and call supplies again, so... We'll go up here and we'll, uh, get this guy out of here. After this, I'll do another main mission, though. I haven't even got to Africa yet, which is another area in this game. I'm not going to deal with that shit. <laughs> they they do um Don't worry though. They do um Oh. Oh, I didn't even see that. A diamond. Yeah. That's always good for money. Um but they do penalize you every time you do that. So they don't penalize you in the game. I, I love all stealth approach. That's just the way I like to play. I mean, there are so many weapons, which kind of makes this sad. I might play this game through again and just go bolts to the wall and kill everyone like a murderous fuck. But this time around, the first time around, I, I like to do everything as stealthfully as possible, so. And there's a guy up there, and uh, I'm gonna shoot him in the face. Maybe. Oh my god! So that was that gun will be awesome! If you have to shoot, be careful. Well, don't worry, I'll just call it, make a supply drop. Please. Yeah. Well, I mean, if you're going to play a stealth game, you might as well do stealth. Um, and this is like the best stealth I've seen in a game so far. I'm surprised I I'm surprised I hit that guy. That was impressive. I well, I shouldn't say it was impressive. It was more like lucky, but Why did I just do that for no reason? Because I felt like running again. Oh shit, there's a guy over here. Let's let's get him to that. That, that. Right in your face, fool. 
Yeah, I I never played Arkham City. I need to for sure though. Oh shit, that's right. I don't have a silencer. Fuck. Oh well, well, um He's coming too. Roger that. When I say I don't do stealth, I don't do stealth if I get caught. Like like those guys are still looking for me, but Oh, and all my shit's way the fuck over there. Uh, uh. I love how the music tenses up, too. Like, they're looking for me, but if they can't find me, then that's good on me. I wouldn't say Metal Gear Solid is the first stealth game, but I mean, uh, the first one came out in 1987, and even though it was crude, it was still pretty good for stealth. And this is definitely Kojima's A game stuff right here. Where'd that other guy go? Oh yeah, I extracted. Yeah, they're running way the fuck over there. They're not gonna find me, though! I don't know why they have all these walls built up here. Oh, shit! What are they taking with them? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, if anyone wants to make a stealth game, they they usually come to Metal Gear first, just because it's it's it is the flagship stealth game. It's not, you know, it's not entirely, you know, an accurate stealth game. Like Splinter Cell would be more of an accurate stealth game. And to be fair, Splinter Cell was the next big stealth game after Metal Gear. And they... Oh, ah! Ah! That's some good stealthing right there. Let me tell ya. Goddamn glitches. And there are some... There are some glitches, so... Uh, had something in my eye. There's a guy up there. I'm going to shoot him in the face when he climbs. Oh, he's not going to climb the ladder. Is he going to look over and look at me? Oh, it's uh, 6 p.m. Right in your head. Oh, there's a guy over there, too. Watch this, watch this! Boom! Good shit. 
There was a tape in here, but I got it already. When will it end? When you're all on my... When you're all in my army, fucks. Oh, shit, I missed something. Was there a shiny over here? I thought I saw a shiny. Yes! Shiny! Awesome. That's good for money. That probably wasn't the best thing to do, but... <laughs> oh, I can interrogate this fool. Fucking damn it. Ugh. I don't like going balls to the wall, so I, I just have to start over, so. I know it's kind of cheating, but oh well. I'll get over it. Sorry to make you watch this over and over again. I like how we can... Well, thanks for watching, Alex. I appreciate it. Have a good one, man. I'll check out that video, too. Thank you. 